you know, this year getting ready for Daniel Classic, I'm just trying to turn get back to myself. Um, you know, by the end of year last year, you know, I finally was getting back to a, a traditional you know, trademark hardness and conditioning that I usually bring to the stage. It was done for, so uh, you know, last year at the Arnold, I wasn't 100%. And, you know, with my physique, I'm not 100%, then uh, you know, I don't fall one or two places, I fall five or six places. And so that's what happened. Uh, you know, so um, I got back on track at uh, the end of the year. You know, by the time I got to Olympia, I was getting close to, you know, my trademark, you know, conditioning and the hard, grainy look that I always had. And uh, so uh, just went back to the basics, man. Sometimes 100% ain't enough, you know, and you got you to gotta get more than 100%. And, uh, you know, so when that happens, you got to go where you've never been before to get something you've never had before. So uh, that's what I changed. Not a whole lot, man. Just dig down deeper and try harder. Train harder, diet harder. And uh, it's going to be good. No, I still, I still have fun doing this because it's way too much work to, if you're not having fun, you'll be one miserable dude. So um, I love the sport. I love training. I love to push myself to get ready for competition. That's what keeps me going, you know. Uh, I don't do it for the money or the fame or any of that. I do it just because I want to win competitions and you know, be better than I was the last time I was on stage. So uh, you know, the fans definitely keep me going, their support. I get so many messages and support on the, my Facebook and Instagram and email, you know, and um, that definitely helps keep me going. So uh, I just trying to be the best I can be, you know. I'll be 40 years old the week before the Arnold. So um, I thought I'd be retired by this point, but I'm still having fun. I'm so healthy and uh, I'm still a factor in the sport. So. In five years, I'll definitely be a part of bodybuilding. Will I still be on stage? I don't know. You take it a, one step at a time. Right now, I'm just focused on getting ready for the Arnold Classic in Arnold, Australia. And then uh, make sure to let me at the end of the year. And then uh, I'll be around the year for that also. But beyond that, I'll just invite you at the end of, you know, end of this year. I'll evaluate things. And in the next year, I'll take a long hard look at it and see if, uh, number one, I'm healthy. Number two, I'm having fun. And number three, I still want to, when I leave the sport, I don't leave on my terms. I don't want to leave because uh, the sports passed me by. You know, I'm really kind of forced out. So I want to leave it when I'm on top, and I want to be the one to make that decision. And my faith keeps me going. You know, that's all I need. You know, without that, you have nothing. So uh, I'm very blessed to have a very close family. A great wife who's also a top competitor and uh, you know uh, she definitely keeps me going and uh privileged to train at the best gym on the planet for the past 23 years and uh, the owner he's not his trainer champions he's trainer mr olympias so he's the ultimate motiv ultimate motivator so i've very, been very blessed to surround my people be surrounded by people that are very positive and inspirational and uh above all my faith that's where i get my strength from and keeps me going